Hi, I'm Dr. Nanda Rajanish. I'm a laparoscopic surgeon and oncosurgeon. I practice in Apollo Spectra and Healthcare Global Cancer Center. Losing weight after bariatric surgery is all about decreasing quantity of intake of diet. So here what we do is we remove the signals that are there between the stomach and the brain which will make you eat excessively because the stomach size itself is reduced. The quantity intake will automatically get reduced. But what normally patients do post uh, surgery is though their appetite is less, they end up taking or pushing food themselves voluntarily like they eat a lot of bread, biscuits, they end up eating a lot of ice creams, high calorie foods. So it may be just for the mouth taste and they may not have enough appetite because following surgery there won't be enough appetite but still they push themselves in eating these foods. So what this does is it can cause irreversible dilatation of stomach again. That means surgery that is done for a purpose is removed by just dilatation of automatic dilatation of the stomach. So most important is not to eat too much of maida basin which bloats your intestines, bloats your stomach, dilates your stomach, you should avoid. And you should also make sure you take adequate quantities of proteins that is needed to your body. Especially if you are losing hair, that means you are protein deficient, that needs to be attended. And if you are developing thin nails, dropping of the nails, dryness, dryness of the skin, that means you are becoming protein deficiency, deficient. So adequate protein intake, multivitamin micronutrient intake, vitamin D supplementation, vitamin B12 supplementation can itself prevent increasing weight post bariatric surgery. So we call it failure of bariatric surgery which is especially common after 5 years if you do not have a good knowledge of follow up of this surgery.